And we have local team coverage on this tragic story. 10 on your side's Matt Gregory talked to the president of the Hampton Roads Pride, who says they are preparing for a vigil tonight. Matt? Yeah, Brandy, tonight, just a few hours, uh, at around 845, the largest LGBTQ organization in Hampton Roads, Hampton Roads Pride, is going to have a vigil for those victims. And the president of Hampton Roads Pride tells me when an event like this happens in such a tight-knit community, you feel the ramifications even all the way up here. And just a couple of days before Hampton Roads Pride Fest, it's hard not to see how the tragedy has struck so many here. Now, today we spoke with Michael Berlucci. He's the president of Hampton Roads Pride. Berlucci says they gathered more information on the shooting in Orlando over the course of the day. And as the magnitude of both the crime and the death toll rose throughout the day, he says it struck a devastating chord within the LGBTQ community. Tonight, last year we were celebrating because our Pride Fest um, co uh, coincided with the historic um, landmark Supreme Court ruling equalizing marriage across the, the country. Um, this year we're grieving. We're grieving for the loss of, of um, our friends uh, in Orlando. So that'll be at 845 tonight here at WHRO in Norfolk. They'll be having the vigil to remember the victims in Orlando. Brandy? And you know, Matt, there are several events that are planned for Pride Fest this week. Have any of those arrangements changed because of this? And will there be extra security? Yeah, Berlucci says they had planned on having extra security regardless. They had a pretty good security plan, he felt like, uh, for Pride Fest and the Pride Fest events throughout the week. But he did say they will be speaking uh, with other groups and communities, uh, leaders in the area to find out what else they could do. And uh, he also reminded me that Norfolk does have a liaison with the LGBTQ community, and they'll be checking with them uh, over the course of the week and as we get closer to Pride Fest to make sure everything's okay in Norfolk for the folks to um, really be able to celebrate and also at the same time now grieve what's happened in Orlando during Hampton Roads Pride Fest. In Norfolk, I'm Matt Gregory. Tell on your side.